What's going on there, crew? Welcome, welcome. Everybody see me? Everybody hear me? Let me know. I'm going to hop on all of the devices here for at least a few minutes just to get everybody here. Had a little late announcement on this one, so let's get everybody else in the house. So I'm going to go Instagram here. Instagram's getting ready to go live. We are live on Instagram. I'm getting ready to go live on Facebook. Let's start that video up. Instagram, what's up? Facebook, what's up? YouTube, what's up? TikTok, what's up? Four different spots right now. This is kind of crazy because I'm looking at myself like five times. But here's what we got. Here's what we got tonight. All right? Here's what we got tonight. I always like to mix it up. I always, always like to do things a little bit different. So what we're going to do tonight is we're just going to have fun and play around and test some stuff. All right? That worked for you guys. So instead of having like a, a set, we're going to do this, 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 and this. I just want to test. By the way, All-Star members, you guys knew before everybody else, right? But did everybody see the new material? that we just released today. So this material, again, just like our other, the cool change, color changing ones, um, we, when we produce these and manufacture them, we get a special adhesive on the back of them to make the adhesive a little bit stronger to where with these color changing ones, you don't even necessarily have to use vinyl shield with it, which is pretty awesome. Because any of you that have used some of the color changing, you guys know how awesome it is and the cool color changing. But with these, you don't even have to put the vinyl shield on it because that adhesive on the back of it is so strong. So it's going to be pretty sweet. TikTok, what's up? TikTok is leading. TikTok's the leader in the clubhouse right now. What's up with that? TikTok. TikTok actually, oh, not anymore. Here comes YouTube. TikTok actually had more people than YouTube for a minute there. Hey, uh, Facebook, Facebook and Instagram, I'm going to hang with you guys for a little bit, but head over to the, the YouTube channel. I'm going to be doing some giveaways, of course, and um, we're going to be working with some pretty cool vinyl. So let me grab a couple of them just to kind of show you what we're talking about here and what we got going on tonight. And give me a yes or a no if you have used, yes or a no if you've used this material before, okay? These ones we've had for a while, right? So this is our limeade, this is our dragon fruit, and then this is our arctic blue, all right? I'm seeing a, I'm actually seeing more no's than yeses. Wow, look at you guys. Okay, so my next question is, did you even know about these materials, yes or no? I'm thinking a lot of those no's, and I see a lot of the no's are, especially on YouTube, are regular names, where obviously probably a lot of newbies here tonight, which is awesome. So I appreciate you guys coming by. All right, so let me give you an idea of what these do. So I'm just going to get a water here. It's just nice water. And this one right here, all right, obviously you don't have to dip it in water. I just want to do this to kind of show you real quick. So this is the Arctic blue right here. So you can see it's actually a clear material. It has a white carrier, but it's basically clear, okay? So when I go here and bring it up, now it's blue. It's pretty sweet, isn't it? So this is our color changing adhesive vinyl. So when you put it on uh, a Starbucks cup, uh, any type of tumbler, any of our save a cup, different save a cup tumblers and whatnot, it's going to turn blue when it's cold, but then when you drink or it's not a cold drink, then it's going to stay that clear color. And watch, if I put my hands over it and kind of warm it up again, see how it's turning back now? because it's not as cold anymore, all right? So that is the Arctic Blue. And now 
Here's the thing. I always like to tell you guys, if there is a special coupon code, I always like to tell you ahead of time. So, Because what most people will do, they'll be like, oh, crap, Matt's showing this final. It's about to be out of stock on the website. So if, if you're on YouTube, I have a special coupon code for everybody, and it will run through tomorrow. It's 10% off all ColorSpark adhesive vinyls. So our brand new colors that we just released today will also work with that 10%. So if you look... On YouTube, it is Matt Live CS Adhesive 10. And if you're on YouTube, you'll actually see it. Um, anybody, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, if you guys could type in the coupon code that you see, I'd appreciate it. All right. The next one is our Limeade. Think of this, and I, obviously we couldn't call it this or anything, but think of this like Sprite. And here's the reason why I say think of it like Sprite. It's a bright yellow, but then as soon as we put this in the water, cold water, check it out. Now it's a dark green, like a hunter green. So this is the limeade. And then again, I go here, warm it up a little bit, and it's going to start to change back. So Instagram, I know you guys are, have like a little glare there. It is Mountain Dew. Actually, I'm I, Kelsey. I'm more of a Mountain Dew fan as well. So let's go Mountain Dew instead of Sprite. All right. So that's that one. Next one we have, and I think it's everybody's favorite. And I, well, the one way I kind of know it is is everybody. We sold out of this. We got more in stock. We actually just got more in today. Okay, but our first round of this, we sold out in the first like 20 minutes. Okay, this is our dragon fruit. So the dragon fruit is pink. And then, oh, we got a 7-Up fan over here. And then pink to purple. So pink to a nice dark purple, that is the dragon fruit. And then again, as soon as the drink... Now, here's the thing that I see a lot of people doing, and, and obviously, yes, this is a permanent adhesive. A lot of people think that these can only be used on cups and tumblers. So I got a question for you. How many of you live up north when we release these? I know a lot of you. Tell me if it happened to you, because it's, it's pretty crazy, right? How many of you live up north? And it's definitely a purple. Um... It's hard to see, in the, but it's 100% of purple. It doesn't look a blue. I'm sure it probably does on the screen there. But how many of you live up north and it was cold when you got it delivered? And, for example, you got the Arctic blue and it was completely blue. And you were like, what the hell is this? Right? Look, I see some of you saying it already. Yes, yes, that happened to me. Yes, me. Yes, me. Everyone, there's someone on every platform here that said that same thing. Live in Colorado, mine came. To, so it's pretty funny. And that's the thing is when you use these, don't assume you have to use it on a drink. Okay. Don't assume you have to use it on a drink where it's going to change colors. Because honestly, if you're up north, okay, wherever you are, if you put it on, I don't know, literally your computer laptop. And if it's colder outside, it's going to change. If you're outside or you're carrying or you put it on whatever you want, okay? If you put it on a car window, well, guess what? In the winter, it's probably going to stay that color. But in the summer, it's going to probably switch back to the other color. So it's pretty cool how you can use it for different things as well. Now, most of us have seen those, but most of us have not seen these. So, this is the Riptide here. And the Riptide is kind of a bluish turquoise off the start. Okay? And this is the Volcano. Okay? And this is going to be kind of a, I'll call it like a tomato red off the start. Okay? Now, with both of these, check this out. And this, 
This just goes to show you because we've got I've gotten so many questions of does it have to be water that activates it? Well, I mean, think about it. When it's when it's on a cup, it's not the water that's activating, right? It's the temperature that's activating it. Same thing when it got delivered to you and it was a completely different color, right? So check this out. I like to show this way. Um, shoot, I don't think I'm going to be able to reach all the way over there. So I got a heat gun here, right? Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see what my easiest way is. You know what? I'll just do it this way. I got some warm water, hot water in here. We'll just do this. This will be easier. Ooh, this is, it might be a little too hot. But check this out. Which one do you want to see first? Riptide, let's go. Riptide. Here we go. Turquoise, kind of a turquoise blue. We drop this in here. Mint. And look how quickly it's changing back because it's not staying in that. Drop it again, boom. It's pretty sweet, isn't it? The Riptides. We're going to make a couple items with this stuff tonight. Don't worry. And then the other one, the Volcano. Red. Here we go. Drop it in. Take it out. Boom. Bright yellow. And then changes back. Same thing. So sweet. All right. So those are them. So what I want to do tonight is just kind of play around with some different color combinations and whatnot. So I'm going to cut some of on a graph tech. I'm going to, how many of you are having the issues with the Cameo Auto Blade? So I had a lot of you guys asking, can you cut on the Cameo on the Auto Blade? And I chipped my Auto Blade a while ago and broke it. And the crazy thing is, is the auto blades have been out of stock for so long, I can't even get one for myself. So, so those of you who are having trouble getting an auto blade, don't worry, it's hard for me to get an auto blade right now as well. All right, so let's grab all of our materials here. And here's the deal. If you're on YouTube, you're going to be able to see everything, okay? Um, no, Cameo giveaways every Monday night. Cameo giveaways every Monday night. Um, here's the deal. If you're on YouTube, then you will be able to see everything, okay? If you are on Facebook, if you are on Instagram, you are not going to be able to see anything when I'm doing stuff on my screen, okay? But then what I will be able to do, Matt, discount code, adhesive 10 is not working. Ooh, well, let me do a quick check on that. Give me one second, because that's an important thing before I get going, because I know we don't have a ton of stock on a few of the colors, and, it's, and I know the All-Star members got a lot of stuff today. So give me one second here and let me go check this coupon code real quick. It should be, unless I maybe typed it wrong. It, it's only for adhesive vinyl. But let me, um, let me see. Oh, it was over, it was overriding something? Okay. Give me one minute. I'll go and check. Yeah, it's been used. It's been used a lot already. For, I'm guessing from the All-Star members. So just make sure you don't have that. Turn off the 50% coupon code. Okay? Turn off the 50% coupon code because you want to use the TRW Release 65 anyway. And then you should be good. But I'm going to hop in here real quick with you guys and do a quick test. Again, TikTok. Um, Instagram, Facebook, you aren't going to be able to see my screen here, okay? But I'll let you guys know. YouTube, you guys will be able to see everything. So if you're on TikTok, Facebook, or Instagram, hop over to our YouTube channel, The Rhinestone World, and you'll be able to see all of the screens. So let me head over to, and I'll just pull it from the main website here. 
I'm going to add some of the volcano to my cart. And let's go ahead and add a design. This is going to be, this is a little bit older design pack. And some of you may have it, but I'm going to use one of the designs tonight. So I discounted it a little bit more again. And let's go to checkout. So I came over to checkout here. Let's take the stones out of there because those aren't discounted right now. Now, it's going to automatically give the 50% off coupon code. Okay. But what you want to do is Matt Live, um, what is it? CS Adhesive 10. Uh, you're, okay, your coupon code is either not valid or another coupon code is still applied. All right, so what we need to do then, I see what's going on here. I'm trying to think of our best way to do this. Because it's automatically applying that. So let's try, here, do this, TRW release 65. And now that took 65% off the design. And then let's go Matt Live CS Adhesive 10. There it is. Okay. So the reason why, if, if that happens to you guys, it's probably because you have a design and the vinyl in the same order. But the reason why it's doing that is because it's trying to get you the best discount. And what that mean, what I mean by that is you can use multiple coupon codes with the TRW Release 65. So do TRW Release 65. It'll take 65% off whatever design downloads you have in your cart. And then do the Matt Live CS Adhesive 10. And that will take 10% off the adhesive vinyl. Got it? Okay, I just wanted to make sure it was working because what I don't want to happen is one of them sell out quickly and then someone not have been able to use it, okay? Um, will it sell out tonight? It's, I mean, honestly, I have no clue. I mean, we aren't gonna, we don't have as many people on a, on a Wednesday as we do on a Monday, so it's not as crazy because on Mondays we'll have a thousand, a thousand plus people on the live. But I don't want to say it's not going to sell out because it, it very well could. Okay. But I do have more on the way already coming in here soon and could arrive as early as this weekend or possibly two weeks. So we'll see. All right. So let's get to making some stuff. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to come over to CorelDRAW, and I'll, first I will show you the actual file that we're going to create, okay? If you're on the main website, and again, I'm going to hang with you guys for a little bit longer, Facebook and Instagram, and then I'm going to um, shut you guys down so we can focus on all of the stuff. I just wanted to hop on live for you guys to know that we are live on YouTube. Got it? All right, so the design I'm going to use for this first one. Actually, you know what? I want to do I want to do something on the cricket first. So I am going to need to bring TikTok down and, and show. So Instagram, hey, appreciate you guys. Head over to YouTube. I will see you guys over there. All right, Instagram, we'll see you guys later. Facebook, same thing. Head over to YouTube, Facebook. I will see you guys there later. All right, now we're back. Now, TikTok, I can bring you guys down to see my screen. So, I know I've been showing TikTok some love lately. Let's go. Come on, TikTok. Flip camera around here. And I'm going to turn you sideways so you can see my whole screen. Okay, TikTok? That's, I hope. That's my plan. Let's see if it actually works now. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe not. Dang it. This might backfire on us, TikTok. Oh, we're good enough. Let's go with it. All right. So the design that I'm going to be using is out of this pack, out of this pack right here. 
it is this coffee pack. It's called the Coffee Mug Mini Pack. All right. And I'm going to do, oh, I'm sorry. It's not that one. Let me do. It's the other one. But that is another pack that I discounted for tonight. The one that I am using is actually out of this coffee pack. Oh, it is on that one. I'm sorry. Life begins after coffee. Okay. So I want to do that design tonight. And I'm sure I'll give the mug away to someone. I think. Yeah. I'm sure I'll give the mug away to someone. And then I'm also, what I want to do real quick I want to try something. This is the only mug that I had, okay, to try this. So this mug right here, it's just a, a matte black mug, okay, coffee cup. And it's a Tesla coffee cup. I want to try, I, I, I want to do it because I want to see how much it's going to pop, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and put the Volcano Red directly to this matte black coffee cup. Okay, you can see one side has the matte black there already. And it's got the tone on tone logo because this is an actual coffee cup. It was made by them. But on the other side, I want to put the logo and I'm telling you ahead of time, I'm not giving this one away. <laughs> All right. So, I already just did a quick little logo. So, I'm going to do this one in Cricut. So, let's go to Design Space. How many Cricut users we got in the house? Let me know where my Cricut users at. So, within Design Space, I'm going to go New Project. And I am going to go Upload. I'm going to upload an image. Whoa, we got a boatload of Cricut users in the house tonight. Let's go. Hey, at least you guys are probably pretty happy after the devastating news on Friday, right? So at least they're kind of going back on that and not limiting for those of you who already have your machine, the uploads, which that would have been, man, I think they realized what they did. Yeah, for now, we'll see what, yeah, we'll see what actually happens. Okay, so here's the logo here. Let's go ahead and upload and let's open this up. So I'm going to insert this image. Now, right now it is 3.95 inches tall. I'm going to bring it down to about, I think about 2.5, 2.6 inches tall. I don't want it that large. Okay. And let's throw it up into the corner here. I'm using the maker. So I'm going to just click on make it. And continue. Now, I will show you, I'll show you the settings that I'm using. You can see I have all of my Color Spark materials built in here already. All right. But let me go to Browse All Materials and let's go to Material Settings. So, currently, right now, for the Color Spark Color Changing Adhesive Vinyl, I'm going to set it at about 210. So I'm at 210, single cut, fine point blade. Got it? 210, single cut, fine point blade. So let's go ahead over here and set up our materials. All right. Heading on over to now TikTok. I got a sweet little addition. Those of you who are on YouTube and TikTok, Check out the camera lens I got here on the phone now. And it gives them a wide angle. So you're able to see a lot more TikTok. Look at that. Sweet. All right. So we got all, ooh, I got another. Do you guys like it when I show you little tricks and little hacks? I'm assuming you do, right? I made up a new one today that's pretty awesome. I'll show you guys before I make the videos on it. How about that? All right. Um, got a notification. Graph Tech will be here Saturday. Let's go, Pat. That's what I'm talking about. All right. So what I need to do, I am going to cut the red. And Oh, shoot. Wrong cutter. <laughs> yeah, I know. 
You guys would do the same thing, right? Which cutter would you go to first? The Graph Tech or the Maker? All right. Now we're over at this cutter. So, those of you guys who haven't seen the rhinestone top. All right. Got my TRW cutting mat here. And I am going to get some of our Volcano Red. Okay, some of our Volcano... Oh, I'll show you it now. So, remember how I was saying it doesn't really matter if there's water involved? So, check it out. With a heat gun, check out how cool this is. We got our bright red. Look how quick that turns yellow. So cool, isn't it? So that's what I'm saying. It's all heat activated. So don't think of it like you have to be using a tumbler and it has to be water or anything. All right, so let's go ahead and drop this on here. Let's get this loaded up. And yes, um, I see a lot of you asking. Yes, it changes. This one changes with heat. The other one, we have three that change with cold, two that change with heat now. All right, so good to go there. I'm coming over and I'm going to choose the Color Spark color changing setting, which is 210 for my force. And let's click there. Oh, hit the back, damn it. TikTok, we buffering? Hold on, TikTok. Let me try and get on the Wi Fi, see if it's better. TikTok, you better now? TikTok is broken. We good, TikTok? Let me know. Still no? Not yet, but you guys can hear me? That's weird. It says good connection, too. Hold on. Let me just flip camera around. Can you guys see me now? See me now. See me now. Can't see me. See me now. See me now. Let's flip camera back around. TikTok, anything? If not... That's crazy. The chat is working. You can't hear me. Okay, TikTok, I'm going to hop out and hop back in. I'm going to log out and log back in, TikTok. All right? Even though you can't hear me. I'm, I'm talking to nobody. All right, TikTok, I'm logging out, out, and back in. That was my sign language. All right, here we go, boom, and let's go live, and live, vinyl, training, boom, done, and go live. All right, TikTok, we're heading back. TikTok, what up? Let me know if you guys can hear me now. All right, let's go ahead and get this weeded. The YouTube crew is still here. YouTube, let me know if TikTok is uh, better now. Live ended on TikTok. Yeah, I restarted it. Can you guys hear me now? Can you see me now? Always roll your material off from the back. Roll it off your cutting mat. Don't pull it off your cutting mat. If you pull it off your cutting mat, a lot of times it'll rip and leave... Um, are we live? We're good, TikTok? Working now? Oh, sweet. Let's go, baby. All right, so what I'm doing here is I'm just making a little coffee cup. 
And the coffee cup on make. Ooh, do you guys want to try something? Of course you do. That was a dumb question. Do you guys want to try and see if... You want to see if the lint roller will pick up the color changing color spark? I want to see. So I guess you guys don't have a choice. And honestly, I don't even need this full size. So I'm not going to rip it off like I normally would. I'm actually going to trim it off here. All right. So I'm going to see if the lint roller is a strong, look how easy that weeded. Freaking so easy, even cutting it with the Cricut. I didn't even need the light board there. All right, so I am using my clear lint roller. And let's drop that there. The big question is, will it pull it up? All right, so let me grab my little tumbler holder here. Again, this is a Tesla coffee mug. Okay, you can see it's freaking my favorite because it's tone on tone. But what my goal is, what my goal is, is I want to see if this, what do you guys think? Do you think the red is still going to pop on this? And this, this cup's probably four years old. Do you think the red is going to pop or is it going to kind of be tough? TikTok, tap that screen up, baby. Let's go, TikTok. Tap it up. Do you think it's going to pop or do you think it's going to not look great on the black? I think the way this red is, I definitely think it's going to pop. So first thing we've got to see, is it going to release? What? That was perfect. Okay, so here's my little hack for you guys today. You guys ready for it? So, how many of you, when you're doing something like a coffee cup like this, okay? How many of you sometimes have a hard time lining it up? And when you commit to it and it touches, you're kind of done, right? But it's a round cup, so it's difficult to get it lined up sometimes. Does everybody agree with me? So, you know what I do. Everybody always thinks parchment paper is just for layering vinyl. Parchment paper is awesome for application as well. Okay, so let me know if you've never done it this way. So what I'm doing, watch, I'm basically putting the decal onto the parchment paper and then I can move it all around. See that? And now I can make sure it's all lined up good. And I can say, mm, no, yes, no. See how I can move it? And then I can go and say, mm, I'm going to go a little bit higher on it. Trying to line up the Tesla with the bottom there. And I'm going to go ahead and commit. Now when I commit, I'm going to go to that right side, okay, lift this up, pull the parchment paper out, and now I can just drop it down. And there you go. Oh, this is going to pop. Man, that released so good. Look at that. That looks so damn good. Man, I wish I could sell these. <laughs> I would sell so many of these. Oh my goodness. Okay, so do you want to see where this gets next level now? This is where it gets next level. You guys ready for this? So... It's probably going to do it pretty quick, I'm assuming. I'm going to use this guy here. 
this guy here and we are just going to just pour in some hot water and it's not burning hot anymore so I don't know how long it's oh wow it's doing it already look at that it's already going the whole bottom Tesla is almost yellow already. Now it's halfway up the logo. Oh, that's so freaking cool. Yeah, I'll put some more in. We'll fill it all the way up. Or I'll, I'll go almost all the way to the top. Not quite all the way. And watch what it's going to do. Get you guys there, TikTok. Here, actually, let me bring you out some TikTok. There we go. That is so freaking sweet, isn't it? <laughs> and obviously, you can see how much of the water or coffee or whatever's left, right? Because that's where it's going to stop. It's going to stay yellow right to that spot. And that's why it's Volcano. The red to kind of the orangish where it's in between and then to that yellow. It is available. We just released it today. We just released the volcano today. All right, so let's pour this back in. I want to make sure that this stays hot for the other ones that we do. So there it is. What do you guys think of that? It tells you when it's time to get more coffee, basically, right? And you can see how much that still pops. Now, let's see if I... See, I'm not really cooling it down. Oh, you can see it's starting to change back already. Just because that heat not in there. So cool. All right. Now... I had to do this one earlier on a test mug, but I just want to show you. You know what? I'm going to actually make one. Um, what do we want to make it on? I wonder if that design will really work on here. So this obviously is a great point of where you can use them. Here's another one. <clears throat> I was playing around with this one a little bit earlier. So. You guys let me know. Is it pretty hard to see the name there? It's pretty hard to see it, right? The color change is dishwasher safe, yes. So, watch this. Tell me if you guys can tell whose mug this is or whose cup this is. Watch how quick this changes. There it goes. Boom. <laughs> and you can see I didn't fill it all the way up, so the top part of the M is still red. So how cool would that be to where, and this is, my kind of idea and different plans with these types of materials is if you did a tone on tone, if you did, um, this, Nicole, this mug right here is not, it's an actual Tesla mug. So I got it from Tesla. So it isn't some place that I found this, like the two tone. This is an actual Tesla mug. Like this isn't, that logo right there isn't something I put on. That is part of it. But how cool would it be to put, like, especially on the tone on tone like this, like special little um, messages or different stuff. So when it is filled with coffee, you can read it, but then as it's going down and so on. Right? Um, yes, I did. I actually put, obviously, if you're putting something in the microwave, 
make sure that the cup that you're putting in the microwave is microwave safe, right? But yes, I actually put um, a microwave, microwave safe one with the Volcano vinyl and the Riptide vinyl. I put it in the microwave for like three and a half minutes and it was perfectly fine. And you're not normally ever going to heat something up three and a half minutes. So, you know that's working. All right. Next one we got. How about we just do, I want to do a comp. I got a question. And I was thinking to myself about this. Would, this is one of, this is just a cheap little cup I got at Target. Okay. And it's a hot cup. Would you ever, would anybody ever use this hot cup for cold stuff as well? Or would you just use it for hot? Let me know. I'm kind of curious about this. Would you only use it for hot or would you use it for a cold beverage as well? Bo, okay, I see almost every, yeah, okay, good. And that's what I figured. That's what I figured, especially the way it is. So here's what my thought is. And this is where I wanted to test something with you guys tonight just to see. How cool is it going to be? And we, you just got to think of the combinations that it's going to turn into. Okay? So let me bring all the colors over here. Ooh, all of these. So imagine putting a few of these colors. Okay? And I have a little design I'm going to do, and I'll give this one away. But let's all think here. Okay? Imagine putting something on this cup right here maybe two or three colors, right? And one of them's like the dragon fruit, cold color changing, but then also maybe the riptide, but then also maybe the limeade. You know what I'm saying? So you got to think, if, if you had, let's say, these three colors, right? When it's a cold cup, when it's a cold beverage, it's going to stay kind of the turquoise blue, but then it's going to change to green and purple. But when it's a hot beverage, then it's going to stay yellow and pink, and this is going to change to that mint color. Wouldn't that be pretty cool? So, again, just trying to think of different things that are, I mean, how awesome would that be just to be able to, have a and then obviously when nothing's in it then it's a completely different color so you literally have three completely different looks to your cup based on if there's nothing in it so let's see what would be i don't know what do you guys think if we picked three of them what do you think would be the best combination I'm trying to think. So the Arctic blue could just be like a sneaky something that jumps up, right? When a cold beverage is in there. But you also got to remember it's not going to be in there after the fact. It's not going to show up when it's just on the white cup, right? So that's where it gets difficult. There's so many different combinations. It's like, man, because remember, this isn't white. It's just clear but then it's going to turn blue. So, you know what, on this first, okay, let's do this. Pick your two favorite, the two that you think will look the best. And remember that make today, I think it said make today great, right? Was it make today great, the shirt we made the other night? We're going to put that on the tumbler here or on the cup. What two colors do you want to use? So you got to think the pink and the blue. You want to go pink? I see a lot of people saying pink and blue. Um, dragon fruit and volcano. And then that would purple. That would be yellow. I think the pink and blue would definitely show up the best in both. The arctic blue is going to be a sneaky color, right? Because it's not going to show up if it's a hot beverage and it's not going to show up if it's a, um, if nothing's in it. 
And we'll try a couple of them. Let's start with this one. Let's do that. Let's start with these two, okay? Let's just play around with a couple combinations and see what happens. This will be fun. And that's what I was saying. Tonight, we're just going to test some stuff. We're going to have some fun, play around, test some stuff. And instead of you guys testing it, I'll waste my material and test it for you. And then you'll know if you like it or not. So let's go with, I'm going to bring you guys back over here real quick. Let's do the design. Um, you will not need, no, Heather, we actually, the adhesive that's on the back of this is freaking super strong. So technically you do not need the vinyl shield on top of this, of these color changing. We actually create it with a different adhesive. Have any of you here, and let me know if you have, has anybody here created a cup with the Arctic? Let me switch the screen over here. Has any of you here, have any of you here created a cup with like the Arctic Blue or the Dragon Fruit and tried to um, take it off? Like tried to take the decal off of the tumbler or anything? It's difficult, isn't it? Like a regular vinyl is normally pretty hard to take off. It's almost, I mean, you can still get it off if you try to, but it's a pain in the butt. It's a pain in the butt to get off. Do you guys agree? It is, right, Jewel? It's hard to get off. So that's why that adhesive is so strong that, I mean, I've, I haven't, comp I've done six, six times through the dishwasher with some dragon fruit and limeade. And it was still perfect after six w dishwashers. All right, so here's what I want to do. I want to come over here to, I'm just going to do this one in Corel. And remember the Make Today Great one? I want to, you know what? Damn it. Let's do three colors. Let's do three colors. So this is already, and I'm going to show you a little trick here within Corel Draw because this is a two color design and they're all welded. Do you want me to show you guys? within, I know a lot of you don't have Corel and the wizard, but do you want me to show you how to get it back to different colors? And it's a little bit of work, right? Because this is all welded together. So what you cannot do, you can't just break it apart because watch all of my inside cavities. Check it out. Break apart and it's going to fill all those. You see it? <clears throat> so and you can get to it that way, but here's the way I normally like to do it. I'll just come over here and use my smart fill. And we're going to do make. I'm basically picking all of them that I want this color. I'm going to go, I want that, that color, this, and this. And then I'm going to select the same color. I'm going to weld them together. And I'm just going to change that to purple for right now. Okay. Now, I'm going to go Smart Fill again, and I'm going to do Today. So I'm just clicking on each of them, and it's filling it. And then what ones do we want? I'm trying to pick spots that are a little bit further away. Does that make sense? So I'm going to go there, there, and probably there. And then I'm going to do the same thing. Select Same Color. Weld it together, and I'll turn those to, I don't know, uh, let's go a red for right now, okay? The color doesn't matter right now. And then for the last one, we're going to do great. Boom, boom, and boom. And let's go with great. We'll make that the color. And... Hmm... I'm going to go with this and then maybe here. I was going to do under great, but I'm going to turn that into a purple. Okay. And again, don't think of it that it has to be that color. Once I, once I say, I'm just changing them to random colors for right now, just to be able to see the difference. So what I think I need to do is this yellow. I got two yellows in the blue. So I'm going to make this blue the red. All right. So to do that, I'm going to go there, click on there and weld. Okay. 
And then I need another purple. No, you know what? Let's do the red up here. Let's make this the purple. And then let's do this up here, the red. Got that. It's, it's a little game, right? It's just a matter of kind of deciding how you want it. And then what is this one going to be? Because it's close to all of them, right? What do I not have spread out a ton? I say we just stick with the, with the pink, you think? I think so. Let's do the pink. So shift click and weld. Now, what we want to do with that now is send them all to the back and let's just get rid of our original ones. And now I have a three color design. See that? There, there, and there. So control Z to go back and we're good to go. Now, for this cup here, I need to go, let's see size wise. It's gonna wrap, I don't really care if it's straight because the way the cup comes down here a little bit, right? But I'm gonna go about three and a half inches tall, okay? And let's see how wide that is. Three and a half inches tall is gonna go to there. That's four inches wide. That's probably a little too wide. It's gonna wrap around too much. I'm gonna have to go probably to about, down to about two and a half inches tall. Two point, I'll go 2.75 inches tall, which will be 3.2 inches wide. I think that'll be pretty good. That won't be too overwhelming wrapping around. Okay. So good to go there. Good to go there. And now what colors do we want to make these is the next question. So if we're doing three colors, Hmm, you know what we should have done? We should have done one of them. Ah, that's all right. What do you guys think? What do you want to do? Great is pink already, so that'll be dragon fruit. And then just, we got to think of colors that aren't going to be right next to each other that aren't too similar, right? So that pink will turn purple. The middle one, if we made that the red, it would turn yellow for today. And then the top could be riptide to mint. What do you guys think? So if we did kind of, let's call that the riptide. Or have we still got volcano too? Hmm. Yeah. You think go volcano? I see you guys saying it. Volcano up top. And then Riptide here. So Volcano, Riptide, then Pink. Which, if it's cold, would turn to still the same. It would still be black, turquoise, and purple. And then if it were hot... It would be yellow, mint, and pink. I think that could be pretty cool. Let's give that one a go. Good? <laughs> Everybody's saying a different combination. <laughs> All right. Because what am I missing? I'm just missing the limeade and the arctic blue, right? And I'm worried that the limeade is so bright yellow, it might be a little bit more difficult to see. So let's do this. All right, so I'm going to go to templates, and I'm going to go to vinyl overcut, and there's my three cuts. So let's go ahead and make our first cut. So this one is going to be volcano. Let's bring you guys over here. It is kind of confusing, right? It's like a game. And you don't really know which way to go. I agree. 
So I got Volcano for the first one. Let's do it. Watch what I'm going to do here. I'm going to think ahead a little bit. Check this out. Oh, you know what? Oh, no, that'll take too long. I had an idea. I had an idea, but it'll take too long. Okay, but I am going to cut two of them at the same time for our next one. Because we'll mix the colors around. We'll do something different on the next one. We don't need three of them, so I did three on my last cut, so I'm going to bring this down to just one copy, so I'm cutting two of them, and I have a speed of 20, force of 16, quality of one, and let's go ahead and hit send. I did. I used the Cricut on the first one, but now we just want to make it quicker. I just wanted to make sure to use it so you guys saw the cut settings as well. And then I got to get a blade for my Cameo tomorrow. So I cut, I probably honestly should have cut three of them because I think I could have. But that's all right. All right, good to go there. Let's go ahead and trim this. And trim this. Obviously, when I'm using a cutting mat on something else, that vinyl isn't going to go to waste. So let's move this one over to here. And our next color was dragon fruit. And the dragon fruit, we are going to drop in here. I need some more room back there. All right. Good to go. One for front edge. And again, so I've done make and great so far. Now for the dragon fruit, I want great as well. And then I'm going to do today. I'll do these two. Launch, cut plot CM4. And send. And then as that's going, I'm going to get the lat next one cut up. Um, no, you don't necessarily, you don't need to worry about scratches on these. You don't need to worry about scratches on these. And then on the last, this one I'm going to do today. And that's going to be the Riptide, right? Yep. And I'm going to change that to a different color. Oh, yeah, Eric, I agree. That's the thing, guys. I mean, I just want to get crazy with it as far as all the color changing. But remember, mixing these, like with what Eric was saying, mixing these colors with, like, the opals would be freaking sick, right? Because again, you're going to get all those different color combinations. So don't think, obviously, that you can just mix them and get all these looks with just the color changing ones. The opals, the, the sparkles, the metallics, all of them. Um, the light box, we actually have the link to it in the products we love. So on the main page of our website, you'll see a link. You'll see a button halfway down that says products we love, and you'll see it there. Um, let's go here and here. I'm going to do these two on this one. And let's go launch, cut plot CM4, and send. Now, as that's cutting, we can start... Weeding these. Um, yes, under the production equipment. Exactly. Thank you, guys.
The light box is absolutely amazing, I agree. One thing I do love about all of these materials is how easy they weed. So, when we test out different materials and make different materials, before I order large quantities and produce large quantities of them, believe me, I test them, make sure that they're easy to weed because time is money like we always talk about all right so we got those two done there and then let's get the dragon fruit all of the yes all of the color spark adhesive vinyl is for the sale tonight so these brand new colors that i know we're probably going to sell out of and again, when I release new stuff, I try to do things different than what most companies do. And what I mean by that is pretty much no matter what, you guys, you guys let me know. Agree with me if you do. Don't if you don't. But as cool as these materials are, right, as cool as these materials are, there's probably a pretty good chance... Um, graph tech, small piece of vinyl, can it use a mat? Yeah, 100% you can. But you don't even need it. You can cut small pieces without a mat. But think of this. And this is what, I, what I'm talking about. I try to be a little bit different. These new products that we get in, new rhinestones, new everything, right? When they first come in, you guys see it's pretty often that we sell out of them right away. Correct? Don't you think that I could just put them on the website, tell you guys about them, show you how to use them, and most people will probably still go get it and will probably still sell out of it? And that's where I try to be different than a lot of places. I know the material is going to sell because it's awesome. And... Honestly, I wouldn't sell it if I didn't think I could sell finished products when I did it. So that's where I try to be different in that it would sell even if I didn't do a coupon. But I always love, you guys come to all these lives. You guys support us. You guys do all of this stuff. And I wouldn't be the business I am today without all of you guys. So that's where I always try to help you guys out when I can as well. And if we release a new product, hey, if you come to the live, guess what? You get a benefit of 10% off this brand new material that's probably going to sell out. And then people who come and see it on Friday are going to pay full price for it if there's even any left. So that's where the big difference is. All right, now... If you guys want to try and layer it, again, I don't know if it's going to work, but I will test it. Do you want to try and layer it with, um, hey, there's some, do you want to try and layer it with the, uh, with the lint roller? I want to. I want to try and layer it with the lint roller, so I want to see if it works, so let's do it. Let's do it. All right, where is my parchment paper? I need to get my bigger piece of parchment paper. The way it released that first time, I think it'll be fine. Because it, re it released really nice on that first one. So I think, I think it'll layer fine, but we'll see. All right, so we had make. I'm trying to think of the way we went. Today... Great. Did we go red, blue, pink, right? And then we can do another one that's blue, red, pink. Here we go. Make today great. Question. Which, ooh, this is a good question for you guys. Which color do I need to start with? Wax paper does not work as good. 
Wax paper, the, the vinyl sticks to it a little bit more. You can get away with it, but I have used wax paper before where the decal stuck to it and released, and it ruined it. So I recommend parchment paper. And again, we don't sell parchment paper. I'm just saying that's what's going to work the best. Which one? Do I start with the red, the blue, or the pink? I haven't tried the press and seal from Glad yet. I did see the TikTok on it, though. I'm going to have to try it. Ah, uh, I see some of you guys. Nicole, I see you. Dawn, I see you. I see you guys. Hey, TikTok, what do you guys got? What are you guys thinking? So, most of you are saying the color. I see a few of you got it. Yep. Dawn, yep. It doesn't matter because none of them are layered on top of each other. So technically on this decal, I could start with any one because none of them are actually layering on top of each other at any point. Does that make sense? So I will start with the, here's what I would do. Press and seal sucks. <laughs> Here's what I would probably do. I would start with the middle because I can see there's part on the top and part on the bottom. So it might help me a little bit. Might help me a little bit. Um, Eric, do you know where Matt got his light pad? Yeah, Scott, I got it on Amazon and you will see it in the products we love on the website. So that there, that there, we should be good. Um... So on the main page of our website, halfway down, you'll see products we love. So let's go ahead and roll this off here. Now, parchment paper. Leaving a little open area, dropping this down, getting this lined up. So this is the part where it could be a little bit more difficult, okay? And this is another little trick I want to show you guys, and hopefully this will help you a little bit. TikTok, let me bring you guys in here a little bit closer. YouTube, let me switch you guys here, because this is a cool little hack. I'm hoping my decal doesn't fall off of this. This is a cool little trick I like to use, especially with the light board, okay? So when I have the light board on, because... I can't see where my third one's going to go to make sure it's going to be good, okay? What I can actually do is I can have all of the layers in here just to make sure that nothing's going to get messed up. So where is this going to go? That's probably going to go somewhere around there. I'm going to get this lined up here and this over to here. So... I think that's going to be pretty good. Does that make sense? How you can see through both. That needs to go next to that G right there, which in turn, when I put this on here, okay, where does that go? Oh, now I can see that going through the G there, and it's all going to line up good. And I know what I just showed you right there, That'll probably be confusing to a lot of you, okay? But the reason why I'm saying that is had I just gone here and guessed, if I would have, like, even though nothing's overlapping, but if I would have guessed wrong, then it wouldn't have looked good because I might have put it in a spot where it would have overlapped with another color, okay? So... I kind of know the way this design's set up, so I'm good with it. But had that not been like that, then I probably would have wanted to do that. Okay, so looking good there, looking good there. I'm going to go ahead and commit here. Once I commit to that edge right there, then I'm going to hold that down, lift this up, pull that out, and squeegee down and there's my second layer 
By the way, those two colors look freaking sweet together. We, man, yeah, I like that. All right. Released perfectly again. And then let's come back for our third color. And we should be all lined up perfect, which look at that. We sure are. So everything lined up good there. Drop that, squeegee down, lift up, and then again, squeegee down, and we're good to go. Pretty sweet, isn't it? All right, so let's see what this looks like on, a, on the cup. How many of you here have gotten one of the lint rollers? How many of you have gotten it and tried it? And did you like it? Did it work for you? Let me know. All right, let's bring this baby back here and I need to get this here. This is gonna look cool. This is gonna look cool. All right, so. Let's roll this off here. Now again, let me take the top off. Sometimes I like to leave the top on because if the top overlaps a lot, you want to make sure not to have, but this one doesn't overlap a whole lot. But again, same thing as before. Man, I'm not sure if it's going to be straight. So put it onto my parchment paper here. And let's do it. So again, going a little bit kind of towards the top. I want it to be angled a tiny bit. The parchment paper, I, I'm sorry, not the parchment paper, the, um, the, the lint roller is not something that I would want to use necessarily every day. I mean, to me, application tape is still better, but... If you're ever in a bind or, I mean, it's something that you know that works. Look how good that looks. How about it? You guys ready to do some color testing with it? Let's do some color testing with it. What do we want to go with first? I got some cold water let's knock out some cold water first all right i'm going to bring you guys down a little bit here tick tock and rotate you up there you go and youtube same thing bring you guys down a little bit come on youtube moving on down and let me Crank you up here a little bit. There we go. All right. Let's see what we got. Cold water first. Now, what's going to change here? Just one of them, right? Oh, that was quick. Wow, that was quick. Look how quickly great changed to purple. But the cool thing about it, because I left some of those colors up there, that's still a pink up top. Right? So still pink up at the top there, purple there, blue red. So now technically it looks like it's a four color design. All right, now, yeah, that Color Spark logo is sweet, isn't it? That is just a bunch of our different Color Spark opals, sparkles, fantasy, all types. So, let's go ahead and pour this back in here. And I'm just going to do this instead of with water, I'll just do it with the heat gun to make it easy. 
Watch how quickly this changes. Red, blue, purple right now, right? Everybody see it? Red, blue, purple. Watch. Pink, yellow, mint. Oh, the yellow is pretty difficult. Oh, that mint is freaking sweet though. The yellow is a little bit difficult to see. Look how those, it almost like it turned it into fluorescence, doesn't it? I mean, that is literally a completely different cup. That is so freaking sweet. So that would be if it had a hot beverage in it. And then obviously, once we get rid of this heat, you can see the yellow is starting to turn back to the red already. So when coffee is in it, when hot coffee is in it, it will be those bright colors. When a cold beverage is in it, the pink will be purple, red, turquoise, and purple. And then when nothing's in it, it'll be red, turquoise, and pink. Three, con three completely different ones. I want a, I want an Arctic blue on there. How can we do it? Do you guys want to add a little bit of Arctic blue? I just want to see what it looks like. I have to. You want to? Let's do it. I got an idea. I got an idea. Here, hold on. This will be cool. Um, let me switch back. Let's do it. Okay, so what I'm looking at here, I'll just bring you through my thought process with it as well. I'm looking at the design. I'm seeing, okay, I could drop another line at the bottom there maybe. Okay, I'm dropping another line at the bottom there. I'm dropping another curve. I'm dropping another curve at the top, another line at the bottom, and maybe something in the corner. So watch this. I'm just gonna add to it, okay? So watch, I'm gonna look at my design here, and I'm gonna go with um, this spot right there. I'm gonna do, let's actually do it this way. Hold on, watch. I'm gonna go there and just drag that out. Drag it up a little bit. And that's going to be a blue. And then I was thinking about putting a swirl in the M, but I think it would... I'm worried if we put a swirl in the M, it might make it look like it says something else. I don't know. Does the swirl in the M take away from it saying make to you guys or no? I feel like it almost takes away from, I feel like it's too busy. I agree. And then I'm going to do another underline in the, in the center. So let's go maybe, I think swirls a little overboard. So let's go here. We're going to drop another line here and I'll stagger it a little bit. There we go. And then where else can I put a blue? Um, what if I did this? What if I did this? This could be pretty cool. So the red, oh, no, that's hot. Hold on, I'm, I'm thinking, these, this is hard to think of these. So when it's regular, it's there. When it's, ah, shoot, if we would have made it, damn it. I offset it a little bit, but then when it's cold, it's going to be red. So that isn't really going to make a difference. Okay, so watch this. Watch what I'm going to do. I'm actually going to come here. This is a little trick in Corel I'm going to show you here. I'm just going to grab my two-point line tool, and I'm going to go boom. And then I'm going to come down here, and I'm going to do a smart fill. So and then I'm going to delete that line. I'm going to take this over to here. I'm going to come over and do my smooth tool, and then I'm going to smooth this out. Watch. 
smooth that out so it looks the same and then that can be blue as well. I still feel like that takes a that does I feel like that takes away from the M a little bit though. But remember you will only see that you will only see that if it's a cold beverage. I still feel like it's taken away a little bit. I think it takes away too much. Maybe the T, a little spot of the T here. Oh, yeah, let's do that. Watch this. So that. And then let's go. I'm just going to make it a little bit rounded here. And then a little bit rounded there. So basically, I just made it so it's a little bit rounded beforehand. Delete that. Take that to here. Move that to there. And we can do this in the Arctic. So let's go and smooth tool. I'm going to smooth it out so it looks like everything else. And then I don't think it'll take away as much. Oh, I lost my blue over here. I got to add it again real quick. There we go. So we got those. I was thinking of a, another M inside it, but that would be really cool if that changed to the yellow. I think it would be difficult then. And then maybe the top corner of this M will do another one just to get some more blue in there. Kind of even out the blue throughout it, right? Up in here. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Let's do that. So to do that, I'm going to, I'm just going to go this, drag that up to there, double click it, get rid of a couple nodes, get rid of a couple nodes there, adjust this over to here, and shrink this down a little bit, move it down here, stretch it out here. So you can move these to whatever you want. Honestly, I think the easiest way to do something like that, uh oh, the easiest way to do something like that is how I was drawing the lines. Who knows what I used to call these all the time in the trainings? What did I used to call it when I would do this and this? Where's my training crew at? When I used to do those, and then just drag it up a little bit. Yes, Peggy, build a dam, right? Who said one of the pinks? That's a good idea. That's a great idea. I see you guys working. I see you working. One of the pinks can go. That pink right there could turn into an Arctic blue, right? Let's do that. Then I got to get rid of that pink. So I'm just, oh, I can just peel it off. I'm thinking I already made the cup. Good. And then let's add one more here. Just kind of spacing it around in a couple different spots. All right, let's go with this. Um... <laughs> Yes, I can adjust this a little bit. See that? See how I just grabbed the nodes and pulled it a little bit? This swirls a little bit of an issue, right? But here's the thing we got to remember, guys, is if I take this out and switch it, the problem is, is remember you're not going to see, you're not going to see that color at all until there's a cold beverage in there. So, is that dead spot going to be okay? You know what I'm talking about? Because I agree. I kind of think 
this looks a little bit like an eye. I don't know on the inside of the M. The thing I worry about on the inside of the M, like we said, it just it looks really busy when we throw something in there. But what could we get in there? Hmm. All right, this, this is probably isn't going to look perfect, but I'm going to do something. Watch this. <laughs> Hold on. This is going to be something not, not one of you will guess what I'm going to do right now. I guarantee it. Not one, of you, not one of you will be able to guess what I'm about to do right now. But you're thinking, I see you thinking, I like the small heart, I like the snowflake, I like those. I like your thoughts. I'm going straight. Hold on. Let me see if I have one here. Uh, give me a second. Go here. Uh, ba, 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 ba. I just got to see what it looks like. Oh, this is, oh, damn it. I was just going to throw a TRW logo inside the M and then TRW make today great. Did you say it, Eric? Tell me you said it, Eric. Hold on. I'm going to find it. I got it here somewhere. Doo -doo -doo. Yes, you did. Look at you. That's what I'm talking about. Damn it. I got all these damn PNG logos for all of my videos. And I don't have a... Here's the Corel Draw version. All right. Ooh, TRW crew. We don't need the crew in there, though. So let's just get rid of that. Oh. Watch this. We're going with the uh, build a dam. So that's kind of a pain in the butt to get that circle again. So watch. This is, again, just little things that I've, picked up over years to try and do different stuff. I'm going to do that. I blocked it off and then I click on that and now I have it without the crew. How many of you would have done it that way? Don't lie to me. Because did you guys see what happened when I tried to get rid of those nodes? It did this because that's connected right there. And then I would have had to come over here and try and adjust this to get it back to perfect. So build a little dam and then you're all good, right? So um, I, I would have not guessed that anybody would have guessed me putting the logo in there. So Eric, you got yourself a mini pack. And the only reason why I'm putting it here is because I know it's only going to show up, and it's going to be too busy, but I know it's only going to show up once a cold beverage is in there. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Okay, so I got to go templates, vinyl overcut. There's my cut right there. And let's go load up the Arctic Blue. It actually doesn't look as busy or as crazy as I thought it was going to look. 
and that gives me a great idea as well. I'm going to do, so I'm going to do a TikTok video on this. And if you guys haven't noticed, and all of you guys should do the same thing, okay? Whenever you make a TikTok video, okay, believe me, if, if it gets a lot of views, there's going to be people that steal your video and save the video on their phone and post it on their own TikTok channel and post it on their own Instagram page and so on. Okay, I'm flipping you guys around here. So that is going to happen, okay? But here's the thing. Always, do you guys notice, okay? Do you guys notice in all of my videos and all my trainings and everything, what do you see everywhere? What do you guys see everywhere? So I got 16, boom, sent. <clears throat> like when I turn on my light board, what's the first thing you see? The rhinestoneworld.com. The bottom of the light board, the rhinestoneworld.com. The cutter, the rhinestoneworld.com. Everywhere you look around, like literally on my table, is the rhinestoneworld.com. And the reason why is a lot of people also are out there smart enough. They know how to delete your, your watermarks and different stuff. Well, it's a lot harder to delete stuff like that if it's in the actual video and on something versus just a watermark. So always do that because at least then if they're going to go out and steal your stuff and sh and post it and get views on it, well, guess who else is getting views? I'm getting views as well. Right? I'm getting views as well, so I'm good with that. All right, so let's see. This, this is going to be a huge test. This is going to be a huge test, and the huge test is going to be, will this tiny, that is a tiny tiny little TRW logo right here. Is this going to weed? With the clear material, it's actually easier to see without the light board. Oh my goodness. Wow, it's going to. It is going to. Like this thing is literally smaller than my fingernail. Is it going to get the inside of the R there? It did. Yes. Yes. Look at that. I'm telling Can you guys even really see it? Can you guys, like, the, my logo right there is literally smaller than my fingernail. That's how small that is. And it weeded perfect. Check it out, TikTok. Check it out. pretty awesome isn't it all right now that we got that i am going to i need to get some map tape but remember i put this extra little swirly there that could confuse the hell out of you because i need to pull it off the cup here or do i what would happen if i layered it on top of that nah it could look pretty cool though because when it turns cold, it would be purple and blue together. So let me get some of our app tape here. And come on. The only bad part is when you cut off pieces. Sometimes it's hard to see and find where you had cut it off. This is going to be the harder part, right? Layering this guy after the fact so let me go ahead and pull this up now anybody does anybody know the trick to lay because this material is so clear right who here knows the trick to lay to make it easier 
to layer the Arctic blue when it's because it's a clear material. Who knows the trick? And it's not the parchment paper trick. Different trick. Hundred percent, right? Just make it a little bit cold. So I'm gonna come over to basically my Starbucks here. And oh it's not cold enough anymore. Let's do we'll pour some in this. I wonder if I actually did this, watch. Oh, that's so sweet. Look at that, let's do it. Still peeled off fine. Come over here and good there, good there. Good there and there. And I can't really see that at all right now. It's almost like a, and I'll show you up close. It's almost like a super light gray. Check this out. Can you guys see the TRW logo really at all? I mean, if you're, if you have the cup right next to you, you can kind of see it a little bit, right? But you know when you're going to be able to see it? In just a second. Because we are going to fill this baby up. Oh, already. Like already. Check that out. So now we got Arctic Blue. The um, Riptide didn't change because it's cold. The Pink Dragon Fruit changed to Purple. Riptide again. Volcano did not change, but obviously the Arctic Blue did change and the logo popped. That's pretty sweet, not gonna lie. I wonder if, even with cold water in there, if I... Uh, look at it just disappear. And now it's completely changing again. Look at how it changes back so quick. <laughs> the cup literally does not know what to do right now. It's like, it's hot, it's cold, it's hot, it's cold. And now obviously the TRW is going to come back. The hidden message I love, okay? So I've seen a lot of people doing this, and this is the, one of the very first things I was talking about with the Arctic Blue is on white, the, the cup's gonna explode. <laughs> on white cups like this or tumblers or anything, use the Arctic Blue for exactly that, for hidden messages, because you can make some pretty cool stuff where you don't see it until you fill it up. And then, and by the way, just to let you guys know, it's probably still, we're probably still a month out on this, okay? Let me flip back around here. Oh. So we are probably still a month out on this, okay? 
but we have about 10 different colors coming in that are being that we're producing right now about 10 different colors and this is where I think it's going to be freaking next level so I do have probably at least five or six that are clear to something like clear to black clear to purple clear to and so on so imagine that like on a cup like that it's nothing but then when you pour in your beverage whatever it is right it's friday and you're ready you got that tumbler right there it's completely clear you can't see anything on it and you pour in that corona and it says i'm a happy camper as soon as it gets filled up <laughs> i don't know whatever you want right so it's gonna it's gonna be pretty freaking awesome but like i said we're we'll have about five or six different ones and but we do have about 10 different colors coming in where there's also color change from color to color but i think you guys are gonna love it um let me see i will hold on hold on hold on let me think of where i have this at see if i can get a list Um, doo -doo -doo. okay, so some of them that we have coming in clear to red. Okay, we already have the Arctic blue, so clear to red, clear to rose pink. Clear to orange, clear to gold, clear to black, clear to dark green, black to purple, purple to pink. So the opposite of what we have now. Think of this, and this was my whole plan of producing this color. Think of um that cup right there make make today great okay and it's pink and purple but then when you pour the beverage in it literally will swap colors think of how freaking cool that would be so it's pink purple pink let's say but then when the cold goes in it'll go to purple pink purple and it'll just swap. That will be freaking amazing. And people will be next to you and, and see your cup and be like, you'll fill it up and be like, did your cup just change? It'll look the same, but it'll change. Right? Um, purple to pink, I said that. Black to red. Now, hot. Those were all cold color changing. Then we'll have hot color changing, um, black to red, clear to dark red, clear to black, purple to pink. We, we got so many of them coming. So, like I said, that is, that is down the road. That is down the road, okay? Um, I know, would that not be freaking sick? Could you guys imagine this one that we did if it were the black, right? Black tone on tone. And then when you put your hot drink in, then the red just pops. That would look absolutely sick on this thing right here. Yeah, there's going to, it's, what I'm most excited about with all of those, 
What I'm most excited about, honestly, is seeing all of the cool stuff that you guys will create with it as well. Because that's where I feel like it's really going to just, I mean, I, I try to think of a lot of things, but I, I, I can see you guys already just thinking, oh, I could do this, I could do this, I could do this, and so on. Exactly, Alan. Yes, yes, we will. I'm telling you, if I had to guess within the next... Two months, you guys are going to be like, holy crap. I'm talking with different heat transfer vinyls we have coming in, different adhesive vinyls we have coming in, different rhinestones we have coming in. I was just looking the other night. Probably within the next two months, we will probably have about 40 to 50 new products. We'll probably have 40 to 50 new products between new vinyls, between new adhesive vinyls, between new heat transfer vinyls, between new rhinestones. It's going to be, yeah, stay tuned. You guys will stay tuned. That's why we're all here, right? All right. So here's the deal. Does everybody see... Uh, I told you guys we we're going to be quicker tonight. Um, does everybody see the coupon code over there? Okay. So all of you guys that are live, um, I will check right now. Give me one second. I had a few people asking, "Is are any of the color changing out of stock yet? Um... No, not right now. So all five of the color-changing adhesive vinyls are currently still in stock. We are getting low on a couple of them, but like I said, depending on ship, we have some that's supposed to arrive tomorrow, okay? Because we just got our initial order of these two in today. But we've had a lot of stuff that's supposed to arrive tomorrow and it arrives a week and a half later. So I don't want to guarantee you I don't want to say I guarantee we're going to get more Volcano and more Riptide tomorrow because if it doesn't show up, I don't want you pissed at me, okay? We've had it where it shows up two weeks later. Shipping is absolutely nuts right now. Shipping is absolutely nuts. So, we'll see. All right. Um, yes, I will go through and kind of show you the different things and show you where they all are. I know a lot of you guys got questions on it. So let me flip around here real quick, TikTok. And then we got to do some, uh, after that we got to do some mini pack giveaways. All right. So to find the color changing, I made it as simple as possible, okay? The two brand new ones are on the top. Do you guys like, because again, eventually we're going to probably have 15 to 20 of these things. Does it help you guys having the hot and cold in the corner there so you know which one it is, if it's heat activated or cold activated? It says it in the description, but I feel like having it right on that image will help you guys a lot once there's 20 of them, right? Because some of them, remember, are going to be the same. Like, we're going to have a pink to purple cold and a pink to purple hot. So, you don't want to mix those up when you're getting them if you have a certain project in mind, right? So, that's why we started putting them on there already. Okay, <laughs> Debbie. <laughs> um, too much to choose from now. Susan, you are... If you think it's hard to choose now, I'm telling you, it's going to be crazy. It's gonna, these are going to be a crazy couple months. These are going to be a crazy couple months. All right. So those are there. The I saw a lot of you guys asking about, oh, 
I didn't even show you guys it. Let me show you. Let me flip it around here. Um, I'll do it over here. I'll do it over here. I never even showed you this mug yet. Let me flip back over to production view. So this one here is the other one I was talking about. Life begins after coffee. Look how nice that looks on this big coffee cup. I didn't have a big enough coffee cup because I wanted to make a little bit larger one, so I actually put it on the back of my Louisville Slugger one. So, life begins after coffee. Check this out. Hopefully this is still hot enough. And let's see it. Uh, it's kind of warm, not necessarily, I wouldn't really call it hot, but I think it'll still change it. So we should be changing any second here or any minute here to the mint color. And this is the Riptide. Yes, this design, I'll show you what pack it is in. I dropped the price, it's already starting to change, look at it. I dropped the price of the pack $10 and then you'll also get the 65% off. <laughs> what? See it going already? This mint color is freaking awesome too. I love it honestly when it is a half and half like this. Here, I'm bringing it up because it's changed, starting to change a lot now. I got bad lighting. Hold on, YouTube. I'm going to get you down here, maybe. There you go. That's probably better lighting for you, YouTube. And TikTok, you guys can see it pretty good, right? I love it when it's half and half like that because it looks almost like an ombre-type design. <laughs> right as I said that, Debbie typed it. <laughs> Uh, we're right here. We're on the same page, Debbie. Let's go. So sweet, isn't it? Yes, I, this is the actual mug that I put through the microwave for three minutes. Awesome. All right, let's move back over here. Sorry, I almost forgot that one. So with that being said, where that design is, it's at the very bottom of the main page. It's the coffee mug mini pack. I knocked it down from 40 to 30. And then you use the TRW release 65 coupon code. And what does it bring it to? Like $10 or something? Probably, low, probably lower than that. Um, rose gold is, we thought it was coming in this week, but again, with the shipping, it isn't coming in this week. So hopefully by next week for the rose gold rhinestones, I saw the question come in. Yeah. $10 and 50 cents. It brings it down to thanks, Eric. Um, 6.0, please don't say soon. <sighs> Well, that's what I'm doing right after I get off here in about 10 minutes. But I have a confession to make. Sorry. It's not that bad. I thought of something really cool that I'm adding to it. I kept saying, don't add more, don't add more, don't add more. And I thought of something really cool that I'm adding to it, which is a great thing for you guys, but it's a bad thing for you guys in that you guys are going to absolutely love it, but we're building it. <laughs> Heidi said, damn it, Matt. Heidi, I promise you when it comes out, you are going to be like, 
Matt, I'm so freaking happy that you did that. I promise you will, because this will probably be one of my favorite features of it. This will probably be one of my fav favorite features of it. So, but I, I'm going to go ahead and promise you, um, I'm not going to add any more to it because that's the problem, is it? No, not Black Friday. <laughs> it better not be. Um, no, no, God, no. Well, way before Black Friday. So, I'm not going to... I promise I'm not going to add more stuff. Okay? I'm good. I've told myself, I told myself before, but today I, I promised myself. <laughs> All right. So, that being said, boom. Coffee mug, uh, cameo on Monday. Um, obviously, new vinyl. So the 10% off will work, and I see all of you guys asking that, okay? The 10% off, I'm, I'm, I promised this time, Dale. I didn't promise before. I said I don't plan on adding anything else. This time I promised. So the 10% off code will work anything here, okay? This middle column of vinyl. So the starter packs, permanent vinyl, opal vinyl, holographic, metallic, glitter, glitter textured, pattern, color changing, reflective, and application tape. Got it? It will also, I threw a little bonus in there, it will also work on vinyl shield as well because the other materials you will use vinyl shield with. So it will also work on, the 10% will work on vinyl shield as well. Got it? Sweet. Um, once we get them all in, yes. Sorry. Once we get all of our colors in and we know all of them that we're going to have, then we will eventually get a starter pack for the color changing vinyl as well. Yep, definitely. All right, so I need to pick some mini packs. Um, coupon code will go through tomorrow night. Through tomorrow night. Um, can't guarantee stock of at least the new stuff will go through tomorrow night or the dragon fruit and the arctic blue are pretty low as well but again we should be getting more of all of them hopefully po possibly this week if not next week my hope is we don't sell out at all and some comes in tomorrow and we can just restock it before it sells out all right, where are we at in likes? We have 402 of you here and 321 likes. Everybody click that like button real quick on YouTube. YouTube like button, let's go. TikTok, what's going on, TikTok? Sorry, TikTok, when I got you guys turned around that way, I can't see your comments. So, hey, TikTok, appreciate you guys. We're at 339 likes. Where are we at? Let's go. So, I'm going to pick a winner for... This guy and I will make another, let's see, <laughs> nope, not giving away the Tesla cup, not happening. So, we got this guy. I got to make a TikTok. So, I'm going to make a TikTok doing this after I'm off here. And then I will give somebody that tumbler as well. So, I'm going to give it away before I make it. So, we'll give away two cups. Okay, we'll give away two cups. And, um... But I'm not going to make that other one right now because I got to do a TikTok on it. All right, let's go.
We're at 390. I'm trying to stall. Let's get to 400. 392. Here we go. 393. Where are we at, YouTube? TikTok. Get to 100 real quick so we can do a TikTok giveaway as well. 396. And here comes 403. Two, one, go. Boom. All right. We got four mini pack giveaways on YouTube. We got one mini pack giveaway on TikTok. Here we go. I'm going to highlight name on YouTube, top name I highlight, and the three names underneath that are going to be our three mini pack winners. So if you want that coffee pack as your mini pack, it's free. If you win. All right. Here we go. Pick a YouTube Four YouTube winners in five, four, three, two, one, and what do you think? Go? Not yet? Maybe? Go? Tomorrow? Today? Let's go. Here we go. And our YouTube winners are one, two, three, and four. I got Leanne Ducats. Ducats. Ducats, Leanne Ducats, is that close, Leanne? Peggy is still on fire right now. I got Darla, Telemaker, let's go. And then I got the Kelly Beans. I got to take a picture of this so the call center knows who won. Give me a second. Boom. Leanne, Peggy, Darla and the Kelly Beans. Congratulations to you four. Let's go. All right. Next one. I need to pick a mini pack on TikTok. <laughs> Dale, you were right there, weren't you? <laughs> Dale, is that the second time you've been one name away right now? It feels like it is. All right. Boom, flip camera, and, oh, I gotta flip the camera the other way. Here we go, TikTok. All right, TikTok, scrolling through, picking one winner for a mini pack of choice for getting over 100 of you in here, and our winner is this person right here. I got Lori Ramirez, LL Rammy one Lori Ramirez. Lori, congratulations, you're a winner of a mini pack of choice on TikTok. Let's go. All right. So, real quick, any of you here brand new? Got John, all-star member. Appreciate your support, John. Thank you so much. Go grab all your freebies. Just to let you know, all-star members, okay, one of the big perks of being an all-star YouTube member, like John will get now, is when I release, when we release new materials... Okay, I send out a notification through the YouTube All-Star Membership Community tab and it alerts you and says, guess what? You get first dibs. All-Star members have been buying the new vinyl since 4 o'clock today. Nobody else knew it was even out. So... That is a huge benefit of being an all-star member, especially when we get in stuff that we don't have a lot of stock on off the start and it sells out, okay? So just to let you know, John, you got that member or you got that benefit now. And of course, all the free designs you get. Okay, so what I do need to get you guys to do real quick, all right, let me flip you guys around as well, TikTok. So real quickly, here's the deal. All of you that are brand new, I see a lot of you. Yeah, we got two cup giveaways. All of you that are brand new, you need to go right here, design a day giveaway, okay? Every single day, we give away a free design, right? Who knows somebody? I mean, come on, come on. This is, I guess, PG-13, we would call it maybe. Who knows somebody? that at some point wouldn't have worn this shirt right here. Right? And 
Maybe you would have worn this shirt, right? But guess what? It's free. So all of you that are brand new can go and get this free SVG file right now on our website. Every single day, every single day, we list a brand new free design. Here's another one. Beaches be salty. Think whatever you want with that, right? But again, I guess free design was PG-13 day. <laughs> the 19th is the one year anniversary of Design a Day giveaway. Oh, that is so awesome, Alan. I did not even know that. Very cool. Two days away, Friday, huh? That is awesome. So, free design. Go get it. If you're brand new, every single day we take away one and then we upload a new one that's free. So, go get them each day, every day. All right, one more thing for you guys real quick. And then I'm going to give away these two cups. All of you that are here, here's the deal. Do me a favor. It's completely free. Okay? Click that subscribe button here on YouTube. Helps support the channel here. Again, it's completely free. But if you turn on your notifications, it'll send you a notification each time I do one of these live trainings so you can better your business and learn stuff and learn about all the materials. And every Monday, and any of you that are brand new tonight, every single Monday night, I give away a $300 Silhouette Cameo 4. Next Monday will be the 247th Cameo Cutter I've given away. 247 of them. Debbie, there's another design right there, right? So, do me a favor, click that subscribe button. I appreciate all of you guys who do subscribe. You guys are awesome and I promise you, you aren't going to get YouTube videos and alerts trying to sell you stuff. All of my YouTube videos are training and education, trying to help you, okay? So it's not, you're not going to get spammed with anything. You're not going to get alerts every day. Basically, you're going to get an alert when it's going to help you. Got it? All right, close that baby down, head back here, and I got to do two cup giveaways. One for the cup we made already. All right. This one here. Let's rock and roll. Our winner for the first. It's just the top name that I highlight. It'll be shipped with your next order that requires shipping on the website. All right. Our winner for the first make today great color changing cup is this person, right? And it'll ship with your next order that requires shipping on the website, okay? And we got this person right here. Let's go. Boom. I got Lone Star Kyle in the house. Kyle, congratulations, buddy. You got yourself a special tumbler or a special coffee cup. All right. And the next one I'm going to choose is going to be picking in five, four, three, two, one. Next one, next order that requires shipping on the website is this person right here. Boom. I got Abigail Ar Arnquist. Abigail Arnquist. Abigail, next order that requires shipping on the website. You will get this second one that I'm going to make a TikTok video on here in just a little bit. Abigail, appreciate your support. You are a winner. All right, crew. I got to get to work. I got to get to work. I got a ton of stuff to do. I got a couple TikToks to make. I got some Wizard 6 stuff to go. I need a... Get some new rhinestones made. I got, we got a bunch of stuff. So, appreciate all of you guys. TikTok, 
Appreciate you guys. You guys all have an amazing night. I will see you guys soon. Monday night, Cameo 4 giveaway. Let's go. YouTube, appreciate all of you guys. Sale will go on through tomorrow night, okay? Through tomorrow night, coupon code at the top, 10% off, and then TRW release 65 is 65% off designs, 10% off all color spark adhesive vinyl. All right, Coop. Hey, appreciate all of you guys. Thanks for coming by tonight. You guys have an amazing night. Later.